All right, so I put it together. Took like two minutes, if that. Like I say, it's a quick attach um, uh, bail spear, and um, I like it. Um, it's got uh, a pretty decent metal frame. I don't know what grade steel this is, but it's pretty heavy. Probably end up. Well, no, nah, I probably won't put any hooks on it. I may, I don't know, um, to lift stuff with this, but I already got some on the bucket, so I may not put any on this. It may just strictly for hay. Um, what I like about this, what I like about this is if anything breaks, I can re-weld it and fix it back pretty simply. Um, this right here screws on right here to hold the spike on that um it's okay as long as it doesn't start getting loose i'm, I'm probably going to end up seeing if i can find a lock washer to put on there to make sure it stays tight didn't come with one no big deal um save money on it and uh i'm okay with that um something that i don't like also is these right here the stabilizer spikes um, are held in place strictly by this. You see I unloosened it and it moved. So I tightened that down and it's supposed to stay in there because it's got a uh, indention um, that holds it in. That See the indention that uh, holds the spike in the you can see where the uh, bolt has uh, hit the portion that's supposed to be on to hold it in. Um, not really a fan of that, but again, um, if anything, and I has problems with it popping out or getting loose, and I keep having to fix it like this, it'll rotate. I'll just go ahead and tack weld a couple tack welds on here and uh, call it um, a day. And this, I don't think I'll have any issues, but if so, I'll weld something on there. I went to get the frame for this, and the frame um, was like $160, $150 or something like that. So the spike was like 100 and then the stabilizers, um, I'd have to buy those. So for this, I only paid two. I think 276 is all it was delivered to my house. I didn't have to go anywhere. Whereas the dealer won $800 for the bail spike. I mean, uh, the uh, quick attach bail spear spike, whatever you want to call it. And it just was not worth it for me to get a $800 bail spear when I can get this. And if anything happens, I can always fix it. Um, instead of going to get an $800 unit, which it could be built out of better steel and probably is a lot better built. But the only thing that's important to me is uh, being able to pick the bale up and set it on the trailer or whatever the case may be. Um, so here it is. Um, after I use it, I give my recommendation and thoughts on it. But as of right here, it looks good to me and... I'm glad I got it. So, this is the bail review. I mean, uh, the the review of a bail spear I got off of eBay.